to grow potatoes but they don't know how to go about it and how to do it hi i'm the mad farmer in pangari district deep down in the village of eastern province welcome to my program i'm not a professional man and i'm somebody who's so passionate about agriculture it's an ongoing thing in a farmer if you want to be a good farmer always learn to learn always learn new things is an exciting package. Filled with all that you need to know. Why? Because we always think that onion can only be grown through irrigation system. How to, to do, do it? it. How to prepare the beds until you take them for, for storage sheds and then the end when. when. It's just actually recovering now. Because if you look at this, it goes to just recovering now. It's time to take it back to the land. Make a difference, farmer. Mad farmer, M A D. Make a difference, farmer. It's nothing to do with crazy, nothing to do with insane. Thank you so much for your support. The Mad Farmer. The Mad Farmer. Be a farmer. Be a millionaire. Today, I thought of showing you something a little bit different. I know it's showering. But some of these things is worth talking about them and they is worth sharing. Let me give you a, a, a brief background on what I'm doing here and why I'm doing what I'm doing. You remember this field? This is the same field where I planted um, my, my potatoes and then they got burnt because of the heat, because the rains came a little bit late. However, we didn't give this field like this. We ran up and down, we planted maize that side, we planted sorghum. And then we planted orange maize the other side. Okay, now let me explain a little bit of what we are doing here right now. What we are doing here, we are doing the thinning. We are doing the thinning of um, the potatoes. In other words, I don't know whether I can call it transplanting, but they don't qualify to be called transplanting because these were not only necessaries, but those are some of those matubas of uh, potatoes and then they have to sprout more than one. So what we are doing today is we are, doing, we are carrying out an experiment to see if this can also work out. I remember in one of the chats in, on, on social media, Facebook and uh, WhatsApp, people were asking that since my tuba has sprouted more than one side, can I cut them? On that one, I didn't want to go that route because personally, I thought maybe if you cut, that thing is going to be infected. But that's an experiment for the next season. But this season, we tried to, 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 to take a different route whereby we, we actually planted the tubers. After that happened, okay, after those losses we did and stuff like that, we went and bought about two or uh, three or four varieties, okay. Of course, we bought Jerry from Biabamba. We bought Rumba. Those are varieties. We bought Rumba. We bought uh, Holland from Malawi. And we also bought some Kani from Malawi. These are the four varieties we've actually planted on this pilot project. What it is, is um, the first four, uh, uh, Jerry from Yabamba, the, the next four, um, that's Rumba, and then we've got Holland here, and then we've got Samkani, the other side. You'll be able to tell the differences. There's, in, there's very little difference between um, Rumba and Jerry. I think the difference is uh, Jerry is, uh, doesn't really have a specific shape. But Rumba is usually very round, and then once they stay long, they actually they actually shrink. Okay, that's actually Rumba. And then in, uh, Holland is actually those days tasty, tasty uh, potatoes from Malawi. They're actually very, very nice. And then we've also got some canvas. So, like
is an ongoing thing in a farmer. If you want to be a good farmer, always learn to learn. Always learn new things. Is an exciting package. Like this, after the great figure is getting, then put them here so that none of them die. After doing that, you can do your fertilizer applications after around your Filled with all that you need to know. Why? Because we always think that onion can only be grown through irrigation system. How to, to do, do it? it? How to prepare the beds until you take them for, for storage sheds and then the... And when? It's just actually recovering now. Because if you look at this, it goes to just recovering now. It's time to take it back to the land. Make a difference farmer, mad farmer, MKD, make a difference farmer. It's nothing to do with crazy, it's nothing to do with insane. Thank you so much for your support. The, the Mad Farmer. farmer. The, the Mad, mad farmer. farmer. Be a farmer. Be a millionaire. Let me just continue what I was saying. So what I was saying was, what we are doing right now is that when we had put those tubers there, they were actually giving us more than one. Okay, so what we, do, what we are doing now, we are carrying out an experiment to see if this can also work out, whereby we plant those tubers. And like cutting them, because we are scared, maybe they might be infected, because we haven't carried that, uh, that research yet. We didn't want to cut them. So we actually planted the same. After they sprouted, we actually planted with the, the tubers. But most of them, they were coming out more than one. Okay, this what, what I'm doing here. This is this is a rumba, but I'll show you because we are almost done with rumba. As you can see, we did this side. We did this side. So uh, we are actually doing the last line of uh, rumba. And then let me show you Jerry. Let me, let me show you Holland, where we have we have not yet split them. Come with me. Okay, we we got the number of them so that. We, Okay, okay, you can come this side. I think I've got plenty here because we haven't yet started doing this. As you can see, there are a lot of them here. There are a lot of them here. You see, we've got a lot of them here. Okay, this is actually this is actually Holland. So what we are doing is we are removing these others. Okay, we are removing these others. Uh, we are doing them actually very gently, very gently. We are removing and then just leaving one. Okay, we've removed. As you can see, okay, let me show you. As you can see, this is the potato we planted. Okay, this is the potato we planted. So, what you'll be doing is you actually be splitting. Since I'm doing jelly, this was just for demonstration sake. Since I'm actually doing, I mean, rumba, so I will put this. Um, when we start this party, let's assume those are these because this is a, this is actually rumba. This is actually uh, Holland. You can see Holland is actually red here. You see, and then rumba is actually white. So we come back to this later. So come with me as I show you what we are actually doing. So okay, I was actually here. So what we are doing right now is it? We are uh, where am I? Where am I? Actually, here. okay, very good. So this is what we're actually doing. We're actually separating them. Let's take the same thing. We've actually we are, because we are planting rumba. We want to continue with rumba. So this is this were on the same tuber. So we've actually thinned them and then we've made holes. So we are now actually planting them. The reason why we are planting them now when it's showering, I think it will work better planting with these showers and then it will be very easy for them to actually continue growing. So this is exactly what we are doing. We had made walls in the ground. Okay, so what we are going to do after this, we we'll actually, I think about him. seven days from now, we we'll actually apply this. This is the thing I was actually using to make these holes. I love doing experiments. I love doing research. And then I love discovering new things. So, this is exactly uh, what we are doing. 
I think they usually have the same diseases like that of uh, tomatoes. So after this, after planting this, after planting this, we we'll actually give them about seven days, five to seven days, uh, and then uh, we will actually we will actually come back with B. It's an ongoing thing in a farmer. If you want to be a good farmer, always learn to play. Always learn things. Is an exciting package. After the great you pick up and get them, and then put them here so that none of them die. After doing that, you can do your fertilizer applications after around the Filled with all that you need to know. Why? Because we always think that onion can only be grown through the irrigation system. How to, to do, do it? it? How to prepare the beds until you take them for, for storage in the sheds and then the end when? At both end, it's just actually recovering now. Because if you look at this, it goes to it's just recovering now. Time to take it back to the land. Make a difference, farmer. Mad farmer, M A D. Make a difference, farmer. It's nothing to do with crazy, nothing to do with insane. Thank you so much for your support. The Mad Farmer. The Mad Farmer. Be a farmer. Be a millionaire. Remember with the, the distance here, this is 80 centimeters apart. We did this 80 centimeters apart and then we are actually doing 30 centimeters between stations. This is exactly what we are doing. And then there are also, because like I said, this is a research. There are some times whereby the thing gets cut like this, there are no roots. We are also planting it. We want to see if this can also have some roots and germinate. It's an experimental process so it doesn't hurt, it doesn't break any bone. Don't worry, this is sorghum. We had, at one time we had planted sorghum here because we were not sure that these things would sprout. Because remember, the background we are coming from, we had a disaster. On this same field, this same season. So we didn't want to remove them quickly. So we have actually started actually, we actually remove them now. So this is what we are doing. So now come with me, as I can show you the, the, the ones we did some five, six days ago. Okay, come with me. Okay, these are the ones we actually did earlier. Uh, they are coming out. They are coming up nicely, as you can see the line. They are coming out nicely. So what is remaining with these is just you know, the application of D. We haven't yet applied D. So that's that about this. It's very very important. Potatoes are with prime. As a mad farmer. I love research. I love trying new things. I love discovering new things so that come next season I'll be in full throttle. Thank you so much for watching my program. I always love you. I always feel happy to see that you are watching my program. If you've got any questions, feel free to get in touch with me. My numbers are the same 0977 851196. 0977 money is a business. Remember, when you give you when you send me a WhatsApp message, a text message, or even a Facebook inbox, avoid those greetings. The best you can do is hi mad farmer, you go straight to the point so that for the sake of time, because we are not going to manage greeting how how you how the kids and stuff like that. So this is what I was talking about today. We are just talking about the thinning, uh, stock transplanting and the research. Okay, the next time we are here, we will actually share the spray program, the fertilization program, and stuff like that. From me, the mad farmer, your main man, always at your service. Thank you so much as a farmer. Bye-bye.